Hello and welcome to the workshop. Today we have something very important to discuss. Comfort, an aspect of sneakers, arguably the most important aspect after looks, of course, but comfort is something that gets talked about a lot, especially because similar to looks, there is a somewhat subjective aspect to it. So we're gonna get to the bottom of it, no pun intended. The Nike React Presto versus the Adidas Ultra Boost. Which is more comfortable? Which sneaker is better? Which is more cozy boys approved? Now, I have been rocking the Ultra Boost faithfully since the very first model. The Nike React Presto is a much newer sneaker. I recently took a trip to the mall and bought a pair. Some of you may have seen that video. I was excited about it because it was something new. And combined, two things that I really enjoy, the Nike Presto and React cushioning. However, I had no idea, and I said this in that video, I had no idea they would be this comfortable. Even more so than the comfort though, was the type of comfort that it is. I remember when Nike dropped the Vapor Max a while back and everyone, I mean everyone was asking, how do they compare to the Ultra Boost? And it was really hard to answer. It was tricky because they felt so much different. I say that to say this, as soon as I put these on, the Nike React Presto, I was like, Wow, these feel very boosty, like it's that same genre, if that makes sense. It has that softness, it has that cushiness, that cloud-like feel, and that's what the Ultra Boost feels like. It's a lot different than Nike Air, it just is, and previously, even other React sneakers didn't feel like Boost, but these, I don't know if it's because there's just more React, I mean, you can see how chunky that midsole is, I'm telling you, it is amazing. And the first thing I thought, like I said, when I tried them on, I was like, damn, these are boosty and honestly they are even boostier than boost if that makes sense i think they are more comfortable personally and i don't even think it's a hard decision it's not something that i wrestled with i wasn't on the fence with it i love the ultra boost and there are different models obviously but just taking the ultra boost 19 for example it feels more performance whereas the react presto feels strictly casual to me the upper on the ultra boost is more restrictive which is good for running but not as good for pure comfort. Some of the previous Ultra Boost models were a little less restrictive, but nonetheless, the React Presto upper is more comfortable. So we talked about the cushioning, now just the rest of the sneaker, I still give it to the React Presto. Let's circle back to the cushioning though. It's softer, it's chunkier. Everything that the Ultra Boost is really, really good at, the React Presto is even better. Like that same softness that the Ultra Boost has, the React Presto has, but even softer. Now, another thing that we've talked about a lot is Boost and how it bottoms out. And that's not a knock on the Ultra Boost. I feel like the Ultra Boost has gotten kind of a bad rap with that, but it's not that. It's all foam cushioning. It's gonna bottom out after a while, no matter what. So we will see how quickly this React bottoms out, but I have a feeling, just my gut feeling tells me it's gonna maintain a little bit longer than the Ultra Boost does. We will obviously give you an update video. We are doing a life test as we speak on the Presto React. We're gonna let you know how they hold up after one month, two months, etc. But right now, right out of the box, I gotta be honest, the React Presto wins for sure. If the Ultra Boost is a 10 out of 10 comfort wise, the React Presto is a 12 out of 10. You can't go wrong with either sneaker, both are awesome, but the React Presto is better and I feel like I gotta say it. Unless, of course, you want to run or work out in them, in which case I would give the nod to the Ultra Boost because it is more performance friendly. And the Ultra Boost obviously has been around for longer as well, so there are more colorways, there are more models, but as far as that cushy, cloud-like, cushioning feel goes, there's a new champion, and it is the Nike React Presto. 
point blank period let me know how you feel about these sneakers either one of them both of them i know some people will try to turn this into a nike verse adidas thing this is not that i don't care about any of that i love nike i love adidas i love a lot of different sneaker brands this is just how i feel about these two pairs comfortability wise let us know have you tried both pairs are you strictly nike are you strictly adidas however you feel about either one of these sneakers and or both all other whatever leave a comment below and let us know always love to hear from you thank you for watching you are very very appreciated we will be back tomorrow same time same place right here at the workshop with a brand new video this video has been a cozy boys special i'm out of here